Today's tutorial is inspired by the new movie Dark Shadows, starring Johnny Depp. I'm using my Dark Shadow palette from NYX, and if you want to find out more information on all the products used, please visit my blog. So before starting this look, I went ahead and tied my hair into a slick bun. With a cream liner, I'm lining the outside of my hair and I'm blending it into my actual hair. This gives the illusion that this is actually part of our hair and our hairline is a lot more forward and sharp. You want to be sure to blend it all the way into your hairline and if you get it in your actual hair, don't worry, it'll wash right out. Here I'm applying a basic face primer and then I'm going to move on to foundation and for foundation I'm using the lightest shade that I own and I'm applying that with a foundation brush and I'm applying that all over my face, neck and ears but I do find that foundation brushes leave um, some streakiness so I'm going over that with a fluffy blush brush to just buff away any streaks that were caused by our foundation brush. Now I'm just setting everything with a translucent powder. Now taking a liquid liner, I'm going to create the fringe marks that Barnabas Collins has. And as you guys can see, this liquid liner is leaving a bit of a shine. So once I finish all the fringe marks, I'm going to go back with our gel liner and just kind of make it look more matte and blend evenly into our fake hairline. After that, I'm going to mix a black and a copper color and place that right over my lid. I'm going to take that copper color again and a fluffy brush and I'm going to blend that into my crease and also blend it up towards my eyebrows. Before we go any further with our eyeshadows, I'm going to go ahead and fill in my eyebrows with a black and gray eyeshadow. And I'm going to make my eyebrows very, very thick and full, just like Barnabas Cullen. Now I'm going to take a short shader brush and a black eyeshadow and I'm going to place that on my lower lash line and also drag it up towards my eyebrow. I'm applying that same black color to the inner corner of my eyes and dragging it upwards towards the front of my eyebrow. And be sure you blend everything out. I'm applying that same copper color we used in the beginning to my crease and I'm also applying it on my lower lash line as well and be sure to blend it all together. Now taking the copper color again on a flat definer brush, I'm going to place that onto my waterline. This is gonna make our eyes look really red and tired. For an extra pop, I'm going to apply a bright reddish pink color to my waterline as well. I'm also going to apply a few coats of mascara as well. So now I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the contour and I'm taking that same dark gray eyeshadow that we use for our eyes and I'm contouring the hollows of my cheek and also the sides of my chin because that's gonna make it look a lot more wide and masculine. Taking that same color on a pencil brush, I'm going to give myself a cleft chin. So I'm just gonna draw a line on the bottom of my chin and blend it out. I'm gonna create more dimension by adding a shadow next to my nose. In all the crevices and creases of our ears, I'm applying that same color as well. I'm adding that copper color to the perimeter of our nostril as well. I'm taking a mauve lip liner to define my cupid's bow and make my lips look a lot more thin. Now taking a clean lip brush, I'm just going to feather out that color onto my lips. To darken our lips, I'm applying a gray taupe color to the outside of our lips, and this look is now complete. So I hope you guys enjoyed this transformation video. I also have a giveaway for you guys, and if you guys are excited about the Dark Shadows movie like I am, you will definitely be interested in this giveaway. There's going to be one winner, only one winner, and the prizes include a movie poster of Dark Shadows. That one back there is a movie poster, but that's mine. You will be getting your own. You'll also receive a movie t-shirt, um, four keychains I believe, and also two tickets to see the movie Dark Shadows. visit the link that I'll have down below for you guys to watch the Dark Shadows trailer. And once you watch it, come back to this video and leave a comment and tell me what your favorite quote was. You can only enter once because I do want to make this giveaway fair. And this giveaway will last exactly one week. Next Friday, I will be announcing the winner. I'll announce it in a video and I'll also announce it um, 
Facebook and Twitter as well. So be sure you are following me on um, all my social media sites, which I always link down below, um, and I will announce the winner then, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, have a magical day.